Hello and welcome to the C Skype video tutorial. My name is Sergey and today we are going to speak about 301 redirects. Some of the pages in the store have user-friendly SEO names. For example, this electronics category page here. This is the SEO name electronics. Each time you change this SEO name, 301 redirect is created. Let me show you how this tool works. Let's go to the admin panel and change this SEO name. Products, categories, electronics, add-ins, SEO name, electronics. Search engines save these names so that users could find pages in the search. Let's change it. For example, let's call it not electronics, but gadgets. Here is the checkbox that allows us to create the redirect from the old URL. We leave it checked. After we click save button, the page will be renamed, the address link will be changed and the redirect will be created. Okay, now let's click save. The changes have been saved. Now let's go to the storefront and take a look at our new SEO name. Here is the old one. And here is the new one. The redirect has been created. Let's go back to the admin panel, to the redirects page. SEO, 301 redirects. Here is our newly created redirect. The old URL, new URL and category. You can create redirects not only for the categories, but for the products, also for the pages and create custom redirects if you need. Here you can search for both URLs and with the plus button, of course, you can add new 301 redirects for the old URLs. In this field, you can choose where the old URL needs to be redirected to a certain category, to a certain product, and to a certain page, or oh, the custom one. Okay, I'm not going to create a new. Speaking about one more important thing, if you proceed to the SEO add-in, the part of which is the 301 redirects, if we create new URLs here via add-in, if we change its format, here, page format, Category format, product format, doesn't really matter. Okay, like this. Yes? Oh, like this. Parent page, page, HTML. The new redirects will be created automatically. So you don't have to do anything. Let me show you. For example, page.html. Save. And now we can find new redirects at the redirects page. Here we go. Here is the new redirects that were created after we changed the settings. That's how 301 redirects work. To sum it all up, guys, what are 301 redirects used for? Redirects redirect the customer from the old page to the new one, so no pages will get lost in the store. And what is even more important, search engines automatically add redirects to their database. So these pages, the pages of your store, will be still found in the searches, so the customers will be able to find your store and find the pages of your store via different search engines. That's it, stay tuned, thanks for watching and see you in the next CSCART video tutorials.